should we open presents? Mm -hmm, we should. But since this is a very romantic Christmas dinner, I need to be a lady and like go freshen up. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Oh no, you caught me. I am not cooperating. What are you gonna do? I'm not gonna do anything. You're gonna figure it out for yourself. How? You should answer it. It's not my phone. You should still answer it. Hello? Is Brittany there? She is in the bathroom. Oh, so you must be the infamous Chris. I am. And uh, judging from the caller ID, that would make you Ashley. That's correct. Wow, I'm amazed you guys are still together. Well, we are. Uh, do you talk to Brittany often? Not really. I'm subleasing from her. We were kind of friends in high school. She left in a hurry, and I needed a place in a hurry, so. Why did she leave town in a hurry? To find you, duh. What? Yeah, she said she was moving to the city to find you. So she moved here to find me? Yeah, didn't you guys date a few years back? I was under the impression she knew you really well when she left in May. We had met once. That doesn't make sense. I could have sworn she left to find you. Yeah, we met randomly in a park. Brittany is gonna have to call you back. You're too late. Bye bye now. Vanessa, thanks for all this, but I think you should go. Tim, I don't think you understand. A spirit wants me to break up with Zach. Okay, you're crazy. No, she's right. What the hell? I just got done dealing with Jenny and now I gotta deal with this? I hate the holidays. You want to be with Vanessa. All of these obstacles were just postponing what is meant to happen. I think I can choose who I want to be with. You're right. I I am crazy. I don't know what's happening. I think I should go. Uh, we've been over this before. You were never meant to be with Zach. Okay, Tim, do you see Zach behind me right now? No, but do you see you next to me? What's going on? Is this better? No. What's to understand? You want to be with her, and you want to be with him. So just leave Zach out of this stupid love triangle so he can fulfill his purpose. What's his purpose? Like I would tell you. You two may think that you're good, but the only reason why I'm appearing to you is so I can help Zach. So what, I'm just supposed to break up with Zach? Vanessa, you don't have to. We need to talk. How messed up are you that you had to move all the way back here to what? Get back at Vanessa? No, it's not what this was about. And it doesn't matter why I came here. There's something between us. Chris, I really want to be with you. I've never felt this way about anybody before. Well, maybe it is destined to be. No, 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 wait. You put a little wrench in destiny when you tricked me into dating you. Chris, it's not. No, you knew. I didn't want to be a part of this. You knew I hated everyone involved and you forced me back into it. And you won't tell me why. This is nice. I'm glad we stayed in. Me too. <laughs> Melanie, I think we need to be honest with each other. I do too. I know you found those files in my room. I know you know I dated Caitlin. Yeah. <laughs> but I do want to be with you. I, I want to believe that. Really, I do, but... Nobody seems to trust you. I mean, Tim thinks you're practically the devil, and you went from Caitlin to Chelsea to me. And you don't think you can trust me either. Look, I know what it's like to lose someone you care about. I lost Max and Blake in two very different ways. And I'm not even sure if either of them really loved me, but 
I can't do that again. I, I've been there a replacement too many times, and I can't do it anymore. It hurt when Chelsea left, but I'm not with you to replace her. I want to be with you. Here. <laughs> this is really beautiful. Well, I know everyone thinks I'm suspicious and that I'm hiding these big secrets, but I'm not. The reason that why I'm with you is because I want to be with you, and that's it. Why am I seeing you? Look, Laura, I know you knew all of this, so here's the deal. You're getting in the way. What? We both seem to agree on that. I believe you met my little nemesis. Probably looked kind of like you. Yeah, it told me not to call you. It's right. But not for the reason it told you. Blake is a bad guy and he's mixed up with some bad people. You don't know him and you don't want to. The best thing you can do is tear up that number because he's not going to help you in any way. Stay away from him and we will both stay away from you. I don't want to see you anymore, so I won't. Good job. So, you're the other thing, what Chris has been seeing. I am. But Gina, look, what you need to do oh, now- Oh, who was this guy? A colleague. Does the colleague have a name? It's Ben. And I think I may like him. Well, that's good. You can finally be happy for once. I am happy. You expect him to leave you're happy? And all those idiots from high school are hating you because you're trying to figure out if one of them is a murderer? Well, this is important to me. Well, then you shouldn't let anything distract you, should you? Hey. Hey, Ben. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'm not really feeling up for the party. Uh, you should just go down yourself. You're kind of my last hope here, Zach. Gina didn't work out. What's going on? You need to go back to your old apartment. Blake will be arriving there shortly. What's gonna happen? Do you remember when you jumped off a bridge and miraculously lived a year and a half ago? That was me. Why did you save me? Because you're a good person. And I needed to offset the balance. The balance of good and evil? Yes, he had the upper hand, so I shifted it. And then I had the power. And he wasn't so happy about that, so he tried to make you kill yourself last May, but I stopped him again. And he's been after you ever since. This is what Gina calls a Zazel, right? That's the one. And he's using Blake? Yes. Go back to his old apartment. This will all make sense. Chris. I've had it. I've had it with you, I've had it with your high school friends, I've had it with all this stupid murder crap. We're through. Angry much? Did you not hear what I just said? I'm done. Yes, you're done with her. But you are nowhere near done with this. You still need to go and get those files. Tickets to Spain. For like a month. Yeah, she had this real romantic European thing planned. How sweet. But it kind of gets in the way of murder solving. That's why you wanted me to break up with her? I thought you were looking out for my own good. I wasn't. I was looking out for the greater good. Your little relationship doesn't add up in the grand scheme of things. So, explain to me the rules of this. You explained to me the rules of ghosts, but what exactly rules do you follow? Well, since you asked so nicely. I can only appear to those who think they are good. They don't necessarily have to be good, they just have to think it. Which comes in handy. So, Azazel can only appear to people who think they are evil? Is that it? It has nothing to do with actually good or evil? Of course not. Do you really think the fates are up there carefully dividing the good from the evil? It doesn't work like that. And you can only appear as someone who's living? Correct. And is Azel the dead? Why? 
that's all you get. Except we both can lie. I'm not lying right now. But you won't be able to tell when I am. So you're not really concerned with good at all? I care about what's right. Which is different from what's good. You'll see. Now, about that piece of paper Zach gave you. About why Blake might be the killer? Study it. Merry Christmas, Chris. I have somewhere to be.